Hello, this is Ruben on Vab's Talk. Today, let's discuss these commonly confused words very as a positive word and to as a negative word. Very means exceedingly or highly, however, to means excessively or again very, but should not be. Right? Let's see these examples, we'll understand. Imagine I want to pet a bird. Now, ego. When I talk about ego, an eagle is very big, I can pet it. It's roughly this big. So it's very big, but I can still pet this word. But when I talk about a vulture, a vulture, a vulture is too big of a bird. I cannot pet this big bird. So it's too big. It should not be that big. Right? Next example, she is very beautiful. She should be my girlfriend. I find her really attractive and I think we both will look very good. But if she is insanely beautiful, I'm an average looking guy, if a girl for me is very very beautiful, she's rather too beautiful for me, I would be uncomfortable with her. So she should not be this beautiful, I think. <laughs> Next, <clears throat> James is very tall. Let's say James is 6 feet 2. Now I'm also 6 feet 2. If James is 6 feet 2, he's very tall. His height is a very good height. But if let's say James is uh, 7 feet 6 inches tall, James is too tall of a person. That's odd. Six, 7 feet 6 inches is odd. So it's quite easy and understandable. Very is a positive word, very is for something that should be, however, to, although they both mean same, is a negative word, to is something that should not be. That's all for now. For more, visit us on Webstock, our YouTube channel, or Webstock.com.